Sioux Falls Parks and Recreation has been recognized by the Commission for Accreditation of Park and Recreation Agencies for the third time in three attempts, dating back to 2010. Kelloland's Travis Fossing explains what this honor means for the city. There are about 10,000 U.S. Park and Recreation Agencies, and less than 2% are accredited by the Commission for Accreditation of Park and Recreation Agencies. That list includes Sioux Falls. It really tries to make you better as a department, uh, and it also holds you uh, to a high standard of providing great parks and rec services to your community. Accreditation is awarded every five years. This year, Sioux Falls Parks and Recreation met all 151 standards and received a perfect score. Sioux Falls Parks and Rec has been around for over 100 years, and we've got a lot of policies and procedures in place. We've got systems in place. We've got standard operating procedures. Experience is where many other communities fall short on accreditation. A lot of newer uh, communities that have parks and rec departments that haven't been around that long really haven't evolved enough to really be able to provide that uh, level of compliance with the standards that they set out. Sioux Falls was honored during a virtual conference due to COVID-19, but Kearney says Parks and Rec is up and operational. The Midco Aquatic Center and Community Centers are open and the department is gearing up for winter and spring activities, allowing the public a short break from the pandemic. We want people to get out, recreate, really um, get the exercise and the mental break that I think we all need due to this COVID situation we're in. In Sioux Falls, Travis Fossing, Kelloland News. Registration for hundreds of classes, programs, and activities for the winter season begins on Sunday. We provide a link with this story on Kelloland.com.